Hi, I'm Tim. Welcome to Watchbox, and thanks for logging on. If you love this watch and you wish to inquire about a purchase, email tmasso at thewatchbox.com, the new direct service line for you to me and my crew with your purchase questions for anything you see here on Watchbox Reviews. And today, we're discussing the five-piece limited edition 2019 Debatun DB25 Starry Varius, a special series in grade 5 titanium, which is more scratch resistant than stainless steel and lighter than stainless steel. This 42 millimeter watch is easy to wear on my 16 centimeter circumference wrist because it measures only 8.8 .8 millimeters thick. The 42 millimeter watch, relatively constrained across the wrist and one of the most wearable Debatun timepieces, under 50 millimeters, critically from lug to lug, 49.7 millimeters. So I can recommend this watch for a wrist as small as 14 centimeters circumference. 22 millimeter spacing between the lugs. So the watch has a nice broad planted contemporary and proportional stance on the wrist. Now the timepiece features a navy blue medium rectangular scale alligator leather strap with a monotone stitch. You can see there's actually sheer sided construction showing you the layers of fabrication. And then on the underside, a pleasant surprise. Double alligator, small scale on the bottom, gator on the top and the bottom ensures that the strap will wear longer and last longer. This could be a half decade strap for you. More expensive up front, but worth it in the long run. Now the timepiece features a Grade 5 Titanium Debetun pin buckle, satin finished on the underside, polished on its flanks with a lovely elliptical shake evocative of the lugs themselves. So that elliptical shape, as you can see, is echoed by the ogival curvature of the caps of the lugs. This is the last design vestige of the original 2002 Debatun DB1 chronograph, that ogival or bullet shape, a long-running signature design of the brand. You can see the lugs in titanium are short cropped and tightly downturned for excellent fit. Everything on the watch is of high polish, as you can see, and they are evacuated to give them a gossamer, evanescent grace. Turning the watch on its side, you can see a little bit more conventional than the Bullhead DB25s. Here we have a double knurled and drilled crown at the conventional position, 3 o'clock, easy to grip, wind the watch, 6 day power reserve. You can see that there are striations on the flank of the case that give it a little bit of lateral definition and strength. And then the bezel in a lovely black polished mirrored titanium sheen. Now what sets this 5 piece limited edition Starry Varius apart from the standard watch that came out in 2018? Well it is the chapter ring, whereas the standard watch features a somewhat discordant silver. This features a toroidal or donut-like blued titanium chapter ring for the hour track. And instead of the conventional silver, you have blue titanium, fired blue in a process patented by Debatun to match the fired blue titanium dial itself. So it's more coherent and with a bigger, broader dial able to spread out and breathe, it looks larger on the wrist. You have rose gold cabochon for the hour indices, modified breguet hands, it's sort of a leaf Breguet hybrid in rose gold. You can see gold leaf used for the image of the Milky Way band. And then the larger stars are actually gold cabochon that have been placed by hand on the dial. You can see the company is almost too modest with the discrete Debatun logo at 12 o'clock almost invisible. Turn the watch over, and you can see this is where the fun really starts. I'm not sure which steals the show, the dial or the case back, but each one stars in equal measure, pun intended. You can see that this is the caliber 2005, and it features a full Delta-style black polished steel bridge. There's a black polished plate underneath, so the entire movement has been black polished, specular, or mirror finished. This is something you normally see on components the size of, say, a swan's neck regulator, a stud cap, or a screw. To see it on a full movement is overwhelming, both aesthetically and emotionally. My heart skips a beat. You can see there is blue titanium on the reverse side, and this is the 2016 patented version of Debatun's signature evolving balance. They they have over half a dozen patents on balances alone. This one crafted of blue titanium with white gold masses. It features all of its mass on the rim for maximum polar moment. And all of this is achieved without compromising the beat rate of the movement. Often when you have a massive amount of inertia, massive polar moment, and a massive, well, mass on your balance wheel, you wind up with a watch that beats slowly, either at 21.6 or at 
18K. And the trade off for a big balance that's resistant to shock is often a low beat rate that reverses some of those gains. Here, no such thing. You have a 28.8 beat rate and a massive, large polar moment balance. You'll also note there is mirrored unglage on the edge of every bridge. The screw heads are black polished. Specular, black polished, fully rounded, full balance bridge with exceptional shock resistance as there is a triple parachute shock protection system. Shock protection springs flanking and then Inca block on the balance staff. That system, triple parachute shock protection, patented by Debatoon. Patented flat hairspring with an off center dog leg kink, giving it the concentric beating centered mass of an overcoil without the shock vulnerability. Debatoon's own patented silicon escape wheel to reduce rotating mass and reduce friction. And you can see at the base, a rose gold engraved plaque, individually numbered number two of five, and twin self-adjusted mainspring barrels for that six-day power reserve, 27 jewels entirely hand-decorated, using engineering and finishing entirely of Debatoon's own creation. 30 meters water resistant, so it's not a sports watch, strictly speaking, though it is a very sporty watch. See this dream machine and make it yours on the watch box.